going on guys so I'm on my way right now to go check out this uh, Honda Accord I already looked at it once kind of but um I wasn't looking at that car I was looking at another car it's a guy with the shop the only difference the thing it needs well the only thing it needs is tags but I need something that's good in gas and daily driver and only thing I'd have to put is tags so I'm gonna see if I can argue with the price a little bit about it and he wanted 600 it's an accord wagon it's like a 92 like the square body ones and a wagon which i really 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 like those body styles especially in the wagon because they're really cool and they're hard to find those um i mean they're out there but you don't see them too often it's five speed so uh you know it's the old school f22 a6 motor i think that's what it is um or it's like f22 something i don't remember exactly what the code was it was going 15 miles an hour holy crap um, so he lives pretty close right down Sotomayor Road at the shop. Um, he's gonna go check it out. I talked to him on the phone. I just said, well, his wife told me 600 over the phone. I think she works with him or something. But uh, I'm, I got that other car to go look at tonight, the Civic 2000 EX, like the one I was showing you guys on the picture just a minute ago. Um, and this is like an maybe like 30 minutes after I just sold the truck. Like, yeah, that's how fast I buy cars. <laughs> um, anyway, so I'm driving over there right now. Uh, what else do you guys know? I know. I guess I'll, uh, if I get it, uh, I'll show you guys. If not, then we're still gonna go with that other one tonight, so I'll let you know. I'm at the shop right now, that's the car. I didn't ask him to film or anything, so I gotta be a little careful, but yeah, it's an Accord wagon. Uh, it's not too bad here, let me flip the camera. It's an Accord wagon uh, EX model, which is really hard to find in those, which means it has the sunroof, electric windows, electric mirrors, all the nice stuff, etc. Um, I'm backing out of this on the driveway. It's kind of like a shop thing, and I mean, I know my way around those kind of cars and how this works, and you know. I, I could tell it wasn't, he wasn't exactly just selling it because, you know, he needed it money or he needed space. I mean, he's got a couple more spots, like quite a bit of room actually. So, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm smarter than that, <laughs> but um, the clutch I, needs a little, he said it needs a little adjusting after I kind of asked him about what it, what's up with it, but, you know. I felt the clutch wasn't exactly like the best, um, but you know, he won 600, I didn't even offer it on him because I'm just going to call him and be like, hey, you know what, it needs a lot, would you do like 480, I mean, I know that's like a lot less than what we talked, but the clutch and then I need a car and then I need to put the tags, yeah, it has a permit, but that's like a month, so, you know, I, I talked to him about it, there's always more deals out there, for sure. Um, it sucks that Civic guy just texted me and said, Hey man, there's some people that are offering full price. Mm, and everyone's a little freaking piece of crap these days. And offers stupid and then they don't even show up. And more than half of those people probably don't even offer. That's going pretty good. Um, anyway. Uh, I'll get back to you guys. I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna, uh, you know, think about it. It's not, it's not the worst deal out there that can be. You know, it's pretty cool actually. I'm kind of in love with it. It's the EX sunroof, five speed. It's a non VTEC, but um, I mean, they don't even have VTEC in those ones. So, you know, I, I'm thinking about it though. Oh, that was just cool. pretty good the motor ran pretty good no idea how many miles are because the speed sensor is messed up the windshield's messed up the clutch is kind of iffy the bodies are pretty straight for the most part but it's got like a different colored mirror on one side one fender's a little messed up but here's the thing this is kind of like a classic it's a 91 it actually has the original book it's a clean title the, ta the tires are pretty good the rims are original i mean the interior's in really good shape. The, the, the radio is original. Yeah, the radio's freaking original. It's the cassette player one. It's like the top model order, like, Accord. But, you know, I'm not sure. 
it's pretty nice. He was just contempl contemplating like, keeping it for his kids. He wanted 800, and then you know he's like telling me that. And if originally, and then I told him six to his wife, and she said, yeah, I'd probably do that. And then I called him, and he said, yeah, but I'm thinking like 480, maybe five. Yeah, I'd pay five for it, and the clutch, you know, lasts me a little bit. The trip permit lasts me a little bit, but you know, I need to find a job in order to keep that kind of stuff up, and you know, it's gonna need whatever that's gonna need. So I'll, I'll keep you guys updated, though. This car, but it's my dad's car. You wanna say hi? Just give it a thumbs up right here. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, I struck a deal with the guy with the Accord. We're gonna go pick it up right now. Got the money. Got the dad. Got the backup car. If we break the other one, and we're gonna go pick it up. And there's nowhere to put the wallet. Okay. I'm gonna get back to you guys when I pick it up. I bought it. My dad's gonna drive it back right now. That's the Wago. I got a wagon, guys. And it's a Accord. Oh, it's so sexy. Um. Yeah. I gotta get home now. I gotta turn around. So I'll get back to you guys. I'll show you guys how the car looks in light and sexy. Look how much room is in this puppy. Guys, I'm so psyched. The back seats are in mint condition. This was never really beat up by kids or whatever. There's so much room and it oh it rides so nice too. Everything works. I'm so happy. Look at look at look how nice this is. Bruh. That's sick. Oh, I love 90s cars, bro. What's in here? Drugs? A receipt for gas probably let's see what it is mm, gas receipt 38 bucks at Texaco here in Woodburn 2017 which is kind of when this tag started going bad so um yeah so it's like 40 bucks in gas and the back then like uh last year that'd be like 340 350 it's not that good so but this is not, that's pretty good in gas then. That must have been like expensive gas. But man, it's only like 40 bucks. The other one was like 60, 70 bucks to fill the truck up. So I'm so hyped. Yep, trucks bye bye. At least we got a new car. Let me show you guys the outside. Yeah. 